Hey, hey, did um, did we get an offer for Dick on that cop show? Oh shit! What would they say? Again? You know, it's weird. I don't think he looks that old. Hey, do you know any stars? Yeah, I know a few. Hello. I've been. Uh, this is my I feel niece. great right now. Sunshine. So, sunshine. Have you ever done any acting? I was in a newspaper ad to sell car seats once. Why don't you come by and see me on Monday? I really think I could get you a lot of work in this town. Shelly! Shelly! Whatever. Not an actress. totally appreciate the offer, but we're, we're just not doing any theater, not this year. <sighs> yeah, I know it's Hamlet. Yes, and I know it's Broadway. I know, I know, I know it would be a really great stretch, but um, he's just gonna have to stretch another time. Okay, bye-bye now. Ow, God! Hey, Shaw. What's your first audition today? Uh, that NBC show. And you're going in like that? Oh, yeah? It's for a lawyer in a courtroom. You're supposed to be wearing a suit. All right, chill, dude. I'm just trying something different. No, 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 no. You chill, dude, okay? When they say wear a black suit, you wear a black suit. It's for network. They're not that bright. Oh, hey, dude. How is that shit fucking biz? I need a real job. Hey. I want to do some theater. Right oh. on, dude. Uh, shut up, Brad. By the way, I just turned on that Broadway gig for you. Oh, yeah. Wait, well, what was I supposed to play? Hamlet. Right, yeah. Wait, isn't that a pretty big part? Trust me on this. Right, Dirk? Right. I mean, if you get that sci-fi gig, you can play Hamlet on Broadway anytime you want. So anything coming up for me? Um, uh, well, the, um, they're looking for the lead for this uh, one-hour cowboy show. Shoots in Canada, so they might need a Canadian. Yeah, yeah, right, I could be a, a psychic or something. <laughs> okay, now, see, that's really negative, okay? You have to have a positive attitude if people are gonna hire you. Shelly? I am sucking up dog poo to pay my rent. Dick, I am doing everything that I can right now, okay? But everyone and their dog is doing TV, no pun intended. Okay, I can't get you into producers, so we're gonna put you on tape. God, I need an assistant. Do we know anybody who could be my assistant? Well, I could, okay? I, I could be your assistant. No, I don't think that's a good idea, really, do you? Yeah, that's a bad idea. You know, I need a young gal who can just- Yeah, that is what I'm talking could about. Could you shut up, Brad? I'm just trying to help. Well, you're not helping, okay? Are you full of shit right now? What? Huh? That thing, is it full of shit? What? Well, a little, yeah. Well, it stinks. Get it out of here. Wow. Negative. Wow. Smelly. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shut up. Oh, that is great. That's great. He's going to be thrilled. Hey, listen, we'll talk later. I'm just going into a meeting. I've got to hire an assistant. So crazy. Busy around here. Holy shit. They all look like hookers. selling girl guy cookies. Oh my god, that's awesome. I, I don't have any money on me. I've got some Canadian, like loonies and toonies and stuff like that. I suppose that won't do. I, will you take a check? Uh, duh. Oh my god, you're joking, right? Oh my god, you're joking! Oh, duh, huh, that's hilarious. Oh my god, does Kat know you're here? I don't know if she'd like this idea. She told me to get a job. Oh, awesome, do you have a resume? Not really. No, it doesn't matter. Uh, how about a headshot? For an assistance job? Yeah, you're right, that's stupid. Sorry. Um, listen, okay, here's the deal. Here's the rundown. It's 400 bucks a week. Uh, there's no overtime, but of course, you'll be doing a lot of overtime. You're just not gonna pay you for it. And I think that's just about it. Let's go check out the office. It's awesome. This is it. Is this my office? Kind of messy. Uh, no, actually, it's my office. And the reason it's messy is I'm extremely busy and I need an assistant. Where do I sit? Oh, well, you can, uh, you can sit at the table outside. And if you want, you can, like, 
lie on the lawn and get some sun while you're uh, doing your work. I hate the sun. Are you kidding me? No. Oh my god. Oh, see, I'm from the peg, so Winnipeg, Canada. It's up north. That doesn't matter really any. Um, when can you start? Whenever. Oh, so fantastic. Good. Let's start right now. First task, I want you to go outside and tell all those people out there that the position's already been filled. Chippity chop. Let's go. Oh, and uh, do me a favor. Could you get their pics and resumes? Because there were some really hot girls out there. <sighs> Does this gun look ridiculous? Yes. No. Look, they can just imagine a real gun, for God's sakes. They're not stupid. Yes, they are. Okay, look, you're not helping. And action. Wait a second, what is this thing called again? It's called the Galactic Cowboy, who cares? What does that even mean? Okay, never mind. <clears throat> Howdy, neighbor. I hail from the planet Zix Calcium. Wait, wait, hold on. Is that, is that a typo? Or maybe it's actually Zix Calcium. Okay, start again. Howdy, neighbor. I hail from the planet Zykes Calcium. We are many light years away from your galaxy, and we need food and water to make the trip home. Okay, does this make any sense? Is he a robot or, or what? Never mind, just say the words and think of the paycheck. You know what? I Hold on, I think I'm going to try it without this. <laughs> oh my god, take over sunshine. That'll be Brad's offer. Grant's offer. What's he being offered now? All the late night talk shows. He's on fire. Action. He can barely stay awake. How's he gonna be able to do a talk show? Howdy, neighbor. Hang on. Howdy? I mean, really, howdy and, and, and neighbor. <laughs> Different whole galaxy. Who writes this shit? Anyway, do you, you think they want a Western draw for this? Do they say anything about an accent? <clears throat> Howdy, neighbor. I come. No hail. I, I frickin' hail from the planet Zix Calcium. <gasps> this can't be right. Oh my god. Oh my god. They love him. Oh, you know what? I actually can't tape you right now, okay? Um, I've got to fill so many offers for Brad, and I don't know if this is the role for you. I don't know. I mean, they said late 30s, mm -hmm. and, um, well, um, you don't really read Cowboy. Oh crap, um, but I love your bandana. I just wonder why they call a gunslinger Kitty. You might as well just call her Pussy. And they want a badass. It says right here, Kitty is a badass gunslinger in Dodge City who never takes no for an answer. Let's do it. <clears throat> All right, Chip. Well, you know me now 40 years. We've wrestled together. We've robbed banks together. We've even held up trains. And when I say, I want those ornery critters hogtied, tarred, feathered, and on a rail out of town, you know I don't take no for an answer. All right, Chet, if you don't heed me, you know your mangy ass will be on that same rail out of town. You hear? Hold on a second. So, he's known me 40 years. How old do they think I am, Shelly? <laughs>